Good afternoon, ladies. I'm really, really honored, humbled, and filled with emotion as I stand here this afternoon at this amazing gala event that pays tribute to the achievement of Jewish women. I'm honored to be the recipient of the Bacheva Leadership Award. Joining the many awardees from all walks of life who have succeeded in various professions and who have also successfully balanced motherhood and career. I believe that honor is not awarded for what one receives through life, but honor is awarded for what one gives. Our talent as women is our gift to our communities and to societies at large. I extend thanks to the coordinators of the Bacheva organization for considering me for this momentous award. I realize that my success is not my own. I owe it all to a higher power that has orchestrated my advancement in the business world and has also given me the ability to build a home as a proud Jewish woman. While I may be managing important businesses, I'm always cognizant of my primary vital responsibility of managing a happy, wholesome family. In both of these areas, I am humbled by Hashem's guidance in enabling me to juggle the daily multitasking and for giving me the stamina to overcome the challenges in realizing my goals. This award does not only belong to me, and I share it with three very special people in my life who are my constant support and encouragement. I'm grateful to my dear father who believed in my ability and business-minded acumen he warmly welcomed me into his business corporate world, entrusting me with the multifaceted task of running his businesses. Through his unstinting love for his family and his dedication to carrying out his mission of caring to the education of Jews around the world, as instructed by the Lubavitcher Rebbe, he has been my role model for a life of kindness, generosity, and giving oneself to others. Through his magnanimous deeds, he taught me by example that while we make a living by what we get, we make a life by what we give. I also salute my dear mother, a true Eshet Chayil, a woman devoted to her husband and her nine children. I'm grateful to her for teaching me that to get anywhere in life, you have to work hard. And finally, although not allowed, the special person standing by my side here, my dear husband, Greg. How can I thank him for his love and constant support for his gracious understanding of my aspirations as a Jewish woman in the business world. It is his open-minded acceptance of who I am and respect for what I do that in the long run enables me to conduct a happy, meaningful life for my family. Sometimes I sit back and think, am I being the role model for my children? How do my children view my business involvement? My six-year-old daughter may have answered this question when her teacher in school complimented her reading skills and suggested she should be a teacher when she grows up. To this, my daughter emphatically said, oh no, I'm not going to be a teacher when I'm growing up. I'm going to be a businesswoman. <laughs> With that question, I take this as approval for the job I'm doing in balancing home and career. I congratulate all the women who are being recognized today as leaders in their respective fields and share the determination of all those who seek to further their leadership skills. I am delighted to accept the CEO Leadership Award and truly hope I can too create a legacy that others will be inspired to emulate. Mazel tov to all the awardees and thank you, Bacheva Organization, for providing the opportunities for success.